Could it be that something we have been told for decades about our food is wrong? There is a study out today that seems to suggest white meat, including poultry, may not be so healthy after all. It could affect your blood cholesterol level the same way as red meat. So we asked our Dr. Tara Narula, who is a cardiologist, about this. Uh, so, Doc, it was a small study, about 100 people, but a lot of attention this headline is getting. What, what is this about? Right. It's important to talk about it because the headlines can be misleading. Sure. So nutrition science is complex. And as you mentioned, this was a small study. It was a short study. And what it didn't look at is if I eat white meat or red meat, do I increase my chance of things like heart attack, stroke, or death? What it did tell us is that if you eat white meat or red meat, regardless of how much saturated fat is in the diet, you raise your levels of LDL or bad cholesterol by about the same amount. And you raise them more than if you ate a plant-based diet. So either there's something in the animal protein itself that's raising that bad cholesterol level, or there's something in plant-based diets that's lowering it, or a combination of both. I feel like for so long, cardiologists like you have said, limit how much red meat you eat. Does this change that? This isn't really going to change what we say. You know, there's a, red meat is a big category, and a lot of the red meat that's consumed in this country is fatty red meat that's full of saturated fat that increases that bad cholesterol. A lot of it is full of sodium. And so this study just looked at lean red meat, and it looked at unprocessed met red meat. We also eat a lot of processed things like bologna, sausage, and ham. In addition, what's interesting is that recent research has shown that when you eat a lot of red meat, you change the microbiome, your gut bacteria. You actually produce a chemical that can be pro-inflammatory and help promote plaque formation in the arteries. So there may be something outside of the cholesterol that is worrisome about red meat. Bottom line, she said earlier, more plant-based, less meat. More Thank you, Dr. Tara. Yes. Thank you. <laughs>